G'day everyone, Caravan Steve, and welcome to another walkthrough video. And in today's video, I'm gonna show you the new release of the Sunrise Wild Warrior 21 foot caravan. We released this at the recently at the Let's Go Caravan Show. Boy, it was our showstopper and it did not disappoint. We even had Caravan and Camping Sales do an article. Uh, we had everyone looking at this van. And once I do the walkthrough, you'll understand why. This van has got everything you need. But the cool thing about it is the appliances and all the additional features we've got on the outside that we brought all the cooking from the inside outside so just stay with me and i'll explain exactly what we have done okay lock in all the videos we'll start at the front work our way at the back and then we will go inside but like i said please stay with me on this van because there's a lot of cool features on this van okay so we'll start with the weights on this van this van has got a tear weight of $28.99. Uh, it's got a ATM of 31, uh, 3,500, sorry, and a ball weight of 210 kilos. Now we can upgrade this uh, to four ton because we do have the Oztrekker coil off-road suspension, which can be upgraded to four tons. We can even add airbag suspension um, if you're looking for that as well. So the chassis is a Roadrunner chassis. Uh, they're based in Melbourne, they only use Australian steel, and they've been around since 2006 uh, pro uh, producing uh, chassis to the caravan industry. The chassis are three mil thick as well. We've got safety features of the BM Pro Trail Safe and the BM Pro Sway Control as well. So uh, they're two important safety features, plus we do have a reversing camera on this van. At the front here, we do have the spotlight, and we've got another spotlight at the back of the van as well. And these spotlights really come in handy, especially at night time if we need to, um, you know, get anything from the front of the van, or if you hear a noise or something, just put your spotlight and come and check it out. We've got this massive toolbox at the front of the van, and this is one of my favorite toolboxes, and I'll tell you why. Um, these toolboxes provide a lot of story, but this is the key for me, the shelf on top. I'll tell you why this is so important. It's because all your everyday items that you use on a daily basis can be stored there, like your jockey wheel, uh, your timbers, your chocks, your hoses, um, et cetera, et cetera. So, that's the reason why that is one of my favorite toolbox is because we're utilizing that whole space there. Yeah. Not to be outdone, uh, the toolbox does have sliders on either side as well. So let's open this up and see what's here. Check that out, guys. There we go. We've got a 45 litre fridge freezer right there. And I'm pretty sure that will come in handy when we're entertaining outside, keeping the drinks, uh, the beverages, the alcohol, all nice and cool as well. But the goodies don't stop there. Now, before I open up the tunnel boot, I'm just gonna let you know that this Sunrise Wild Warrior 21 footer that we are doing the walkthrough on is built with an aluminum frame, TIG welded roof, and a honeycomb floor. So aluminium frame, TIG welded roof, and honeycomb floor as well. Um, so let's just open up and see what we have here. Check that out. We have the ever impressive Bush Tucker kitchen. Um, this is one of my favorite kitchens, and I'll tell you why. So the Bush Tucker, We've got the two burner grill that, there. We've got the sink, but we also got a cutlery drawer there. But it's, we've got more preparation area as well, and we've still got um, another preparation area right here as well. So they're just uh, two of the items that you know, are, you know, come standard on this van will be the Bush Tucker kitchen and the 45 litre King's uh, fridge as well. 
We move down the side here. We've got your gas bay in there fitting. Uh, you've got a, your hot and cold plumbing right there. We've got your Aussie Traveller awning, and I'm pretty sure that's about an 18, uh, could be about a 17, 18 foot awning. But anyway, it is, it is a very large awning. And you can imagine once this awning is out, um, we've got all the goodies here. Another thing we can do here, even if it rains, we can add a front porch, which will come out about two and a half meters. So rain, hail or shine, we are still be able to um, use the bush tucker kitchen um, even when it rains. So we've got a spotlight at the front here. And then we've got your two external lights and we have another external light right here as well. And they have the bug lights in them as well. So keep the bug uh, bugs out. Fusion sound system, like, you know, this is all top notch stuff we're using here. Uh, Fusion sound system. So if you like, man, you love your music outside, uh, no better brand to put on your caravan than the Fusion sound system. External picnic table, and that just drops down. And again, it would just help with um, all the entertainment outside. We can just store things. You got your outlet there, your TV connections. But this is the thing I'm excited about. Come over here. So what we've got here is we've got all the creature comforts at home that we've brought into these vans. And this is the permanent spot for all these appliances. So we've got an ice maker, air fryer, and coffee machine. I can't think of a better way to start the morning um, when you've reached that awesome um, spot and you just come outside, it's the morning, the sun is rising on the sunrise wild warrior and um, no better way than just to use your coffee machine. You could even cook your breakfast there or on your bush tucker kitchen and if it's about lunchtime and you know you want your drinks or your alcohol cool down you've got your ice maker right here so that they permanently stand right here and that is their home right inside so all we do is just push that in and then we've got your big external door right there um, we've also got lighting in there as well if you, i know what you're saying they're saying, okay, Caravan Steve, it's great that we have all these. How are we going to run it? What are we going to power with? Great question. So this van is fitted with 1,245 watts of solar, a 6,000 watt inverter, and 4x48 four by four, uh, four by volt battery, which is equivalent to 800 amps of 12 volt. So this has got a big, off-grid 48 volt system that we can run our appliances and run our aircon for hours and hours and it's one of the ultimate off-grid systems on the market and this is brought to you by Innovation RV and um, Sunrise Caravans as well so we work closely with Innovation RV uh, to get to achieve what we have achieved here as well. Okay, let's go round the back now. All right, we're coming to the back of the van and we've also got some nice features here as well. We've got the external shower right here. I think it's a must these days. There's your other spotlight, reversing camera, two jerry can holders, spare tire. On board is also 190 litre fresh water tanks and a 95 litre grey water tank, which we can add more water tanks to the van as well. Might be a little bit heavier, but as I alluded to before, we can upgrade the ATM if you have the vehicle that can handle that, okay? So we're stepping inside the Sunrise Wild Warrior 21 foot and automatic, it screams luxury. It says, wow, it has character. It is, um, what is it, Robbie? Pizzazz. Pizzazz, there we go. Um, yeah, definitely got pizzazz in this van as well. And um, we're actually very excited uh, what we've created here. Um, I'm gonna do the internal walkthrough, some, some cool features in here as well. So stay with me on the inside, because if you thought outside was impressive, inside is pretty impressive in my opinion as well. 
So we'll always start at the front of the van uh, where the bedroom is and then we'll work our way down. I always like to point out in my walkthrough videos about the room that we do have around the bed. So we still got uh, a queen bed now. Folks, this is a caravan queen, which is five foot wide, six foot two. So don't get mixed up with um, your queen beds at home. Uh, when we talk queens, we only talk caravan queen, but we still got plenty of room to walk around the bedroom as well, which is, you know, a big, big feature of our vans. And it was noted many, many times at the recent Let's Go Caravan and Camping Show. So we've got a Sirocco fan on either side. So obviously that will keep you nice and cool um, if you don't want to run the aircon, but if you do want to run the aircon, you know you can do it for hours and hours as you do have 1245 watts of solar running off a 6000 watt inverter and you do also boast uh, 448 volt batteries, which is again equivalent to 800 amps or 12 volts. So we've got a massive off-grid system and that's what we're going to utilize it for. We've got hanging robes on either side of your uh, bedroom area cut out so we've got all the 240 your usbs and all that in there your two overhead cupboards right there above the bed nice hidden latches if you watch my videos you know, i'm a big fan of the hidden latches as well let's talk about the tv so we haven't skimped anything on this van there's nothing that uh we put cheap in this van and the tv is no exception as well so this tv actually comes out of wales i'm probably one of the first one to use it it is a bit dearer than uh, your traditional tvs but you know uh, for the sunrise wild warrior i really wanted to uh, put um, all the top-notch features in this van uh, this van comes out of wales uh, and it does come with the sound bar underneath as well uh, it's a 28 inch smart TV. It's got a crystal clear picture on it. This is, um, this is a very impressive uh, TV. We come down here. So as I touched on before, we've got the Fusion um, speakers on the outside and we've got the Fusion radio here as well. And the Fusion speakers are here as well. So if you like me, you love your sound as well. Uh, the Fusion speakers uh, is the way to go. And um, with the sound bar here, I forgot to mention on the TV, once you're watching your DVD and all that, it will give you that surround sound, um, that uh, it will give you that surround sound sound uh, from the TV uh, with the sound bar uh, down below. And I've, I have put it on, and it is pretty loud as well. well. Let's go into the kitchen area. So this kitchen area, and it's a massive kitchen. Look at all that space there. Look, I'm just gonna, give you a second or two to just put the camera over it, Robbie. Massive amount of bench space here. So this is what we call uh, a waterfall bench and um, tradition, this is what type of benches we've got at home. Uh, we've gone for the timber look on there with the timber splashback, white cupboard doors and black uh, seeds and it really does complement the whole van it just um like i said it just oozes uh with luxury so we got plenty of space on this side plenty of space on that side and this is achieved by uh your black accessories so you, you've got the big uh sink there it doesn't have your traditional drainer that means we get all that additional bench space right there it is fitted with a water filter as well. So we've got the three in one tap. You've got your water filter there and your hot and cold on top. And you've got your double induction cooktop as well, which again, it helps us to achieve all that additional space um, that you know sometimes caravans lack. And again, if you watch my videos, you, you always, uh, you, you'll hear me bang on about the height of the benches and I'll bang on it again. And I, I'll tell you why it's important. If you're new to my channel, um, this is one of the reasons why uh, people love our benches. So they're 950 high. And as you can see, I'm about um, 1.8 meter tall. So I'm not slouching over, right? So, good workable height. We've got good posture support as well, so it's great. I'm not bending over. And if you're like me, I spend a lot of time in the kitchen, um, whether I'm cooking or 
doing the cleaning up. Um, worst part is if I'm slouching down and I've got to, you know, slouch down, sooner or later I'm going to get a saw back. But, you know, because we're at a good workable height here, no slouching, great support, and we've got great height as well. We've got deeper overhead covers, but because we've got higher benches as well, we do have more storage underneath. Um, one of the things I want to touch on as well is, um, Robbie, if you want to move over here, is we've got the beautiful strip lighting around the kitchen bench. So I'm just going to turn some lights off here so people can see. So there we go. So we've got some beautiful strip lighting like that. And again, it's just, uh, you know, just wow. And we've also got uh, strip lighting. Uh, if, we, if we come here, we've also got strip lighting underneath your overhead cupboards as well. So with all our overhead cupboards, we do have lips on them as well. So that will stop anything uh, from falling over. And piano hinges with double gas struts is another big thing um, that we're big on as well. And that just gives you more extra structural durability for your van. We've got the NTE microwave right there. So we've still got plenty of storage in the overhead cupboards. But we do have uh, this beautiful bulkhead at the top with the down lights in and it's shaped nicely as well and again it just adds character to the van and we've gone for the black here to match um, the seats as well and again it just uh, gives uh, what's that word Robbie Star. style there we go Robbie that's a new one it does <laughs> give it some style right there um, but we sit down in the cafe seats um, and I love about our cafe seats is the cafe seats comes right behind your knee. It's very comfy. We do have that those footrests right there, so we can put our feet up and really um uh, there we go. We're gonna put our feet up. I've got the TV, I've got the 28-inch TV, I've probably got a DVD, I'm probably looking at the YouTube and all that. Uh, with the sound bars there and I'm just so relaxed here and just really enjoying this beautiful van. Now we're going to pull out the table. I think it's also, you know, a lot of people pointed out the table to me at the show and I said, uh, Caravan Steve, you've got a decent sized table here. You know, um, we try to utilize this space as, as much as we can and put a decent size um, uh, table so even if we do have guests coming along whether you're playing cards or you know four of you are having dinner we can fit four dinner plates here no problem whatsoever and then we just fold this back and it just creates all this additional room right there we've got storage underneath as well so wherever we can put storage we will and we've got the overhead cupboards here and again piano hinges with double gas struts and we've got this beautiful uh, new padded style uh, cushions um, cafe seats and uh, again it just adds a um, little bit of uh, character style pizzazz luxury now this is something you don't see as well okay so we've got the double roll out pantry right there but underneath here we've managed to incorporate a bin. Now, the bin actually attracted a lot of, a lot of attention at the show and just said, wow, you know, it's very rare to see a bin in a, in a caravan. And uh, we've incorporated this quite well. Um, I just assumed that a bin would be so practical and but I wasn't prepared for the amount of people that commented on the bin and just said wow that's a great idea wish we had that in our caravan so we come over to the uh, fridge so this is a two-door 188 litre fridge it's a compressor fridge as you can see um, really it's got a lot a lot of storage there the freezer size is phenomenal and the fridge side it's probably as big as what we have got at home as well. So um, that's a Dometic two-door 188 litre fridge. And we've actually got a little cupboard up above as well. Um, and we've got also more storage. So we've got a drawer there as well. 
and we've just got our water pump and uh, we've got our shut off tower, uh, shut off valves right there so we can switch to either tank we want to use uh, whether we want to use the front tank or the back tank as well. So from the fridge we're going to step into the ensuite again once again this is a luxurious van off grid off road and we've got the caravan dust pressurizer system right here as well and that's going to reduce and minimize how much dust will come in the van. We've got these beautiful tower rails right here beautiful black towels right there but let's just do the caravan steve let's just do that see we sit on the toilet and we just test out the elbow space yes that's passed again with flying colors on board we have the tedford uh ceramic toilet you can upgrade to a uh, composite toilet if you're looking to go that way but we've got the double hanging, uh, we've got hanging space right there and we've also got uh, linen cupboard with removable shelves so if you wanted to take linen with you, great spot, but if you wanted to go on a trip and you're saying to yourself, hey, I don't really need the linen, I need more hanging space, well we just take out the removable shelves and we've already got the hanging space right there as we've got the rail. Come over here, we've got the deep uh, nice deep hand basin which we can really you know put our faces in there wash our face properly um, but we can also clean around uh, the basin as well which is uh, very important and the beautiful strip light that goes across as well and it just sets it off but if we need more lighting uh, we do have three down lights on top as well but I just think, once again, that just looks smart, it looks elegant, uh, and the full height uh, mirrored cover doors are a big, big feature on all our vans, and you can see yourself why. So while we're doing the video, like I can see myself here, so just imagine I'm waking up in the morning and I'm shaving, you know, I don't have to bend down because you've got the overhead cupboards there, but you know, these, these are a appealing to everyone whether it's male and females and the females putting their makeup doing their hair um, or whatever they're uh, doing but also as well once we open up we've got a his and hers cupboard right there the van is not complete without a top loader washing machine i bang on about the top loader washing machine it's in my opinion very important it's your own washing machine, your own clothes are going in there. You can go to laundromats and caravan parks. Yeah, you can use their facilities. I, I get that. But, you know, you are paying probably 5 $6 a, a wash and uh, you don't know what's been put in those washing machines. This way, it's yours. It's in the van and you're utilizing it to its full potential. Let's jump into the shower. So once again, we've got the black accessories here with the base and the shower frame and your sink over there. And we've got a large shower mold. So this is one of the largest shower molds in the industry. Look, look at that. Look at that, it's plenty of room right there. And um, let's just put the light right there. So. And the, this shower mod actually goes right to the roof. Uh, plenty of room. You can actually put two or three people. I think me and Robbie can be in here having a shower. Not that we're going to do it, but I'm just saying that's how much room we have in here as well. Uh, you're laughing, are you, Robbie? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so at the time of filming this uh, Sunrise Wild Warrior 21 foot, it is in stock to view and purchase for immediate delivery. Um, you can come and see us at our dealership, Sunrise Caravans 290 Eastern Service Road at Burpengary, Queensland. We are parallel to the Bruce Highway. We are the last yard going uh, north or the first yard going south. Uh, you can contact us also as well by phone 073888 or send us an email sales at sunrisecaravans.com.au. You can jump on our website www.sunrisecaravans.com. .au. Um, if you want to know more about this van or any other van, um, if you're jumping on our website, we do have a tab there saying in stock van. So they're the vans that are in stock at the moment and available to purchase for immediate delivery. Or if you want to browse around through our range of caravans, you can do so on um, the website. There are 
you know, there's a there's not a van that we can't do here. You know, we can do single axle vans, tandem axle vans, semi off road, off road, big lithium systems, big off grid system, which we are are known for. Um, we can do smaller lithium systems as well. We do build in timber and aluminium frames as well. So there's a there's a variety there for anyone looking for a caravan when they um, come to Sunrise Caravans. Uh, but look, I'd love to hear from you in the comments section. I'd love to know uh, what was the best feature on this van, because there were so many features on this van, from the 6,000 watt inverter, to the 1245 watts of solar, to the 448 volt batteries, uh, the appliances that we have outside, which is the air fryer, the coffee machine, and the ice maker as well. We've also got the new uh, tele-air aircon. This is by Aussie Traveller as well. I forgot to touch on, on to that. It's an inverter type aircon. It's a smaller unit. It's nice, it's compact, and it looks good as well. Um, but, you know, coming inside, you know, what was the best feature? You know, did you love the bench tops? Um, the amount of bench area that this van helps you. The waterfall bench and the strip lighting. There's so, so many features on this van. Even the TV, which is a 28 inch, you know, from Wales, sound bar as well, smart TV um, you know there's just this van has got a lot of luxury uh, mod cons on it um, that you know whoever walks into this van will be quite impressed but all right folks once again I'd like to thank everyone uh, for watching uh, another walkthrough video with myself caravan Steve I've been enjoying all these videos we've got more videos coming your way so stay tuned be safe and I'll catch you on the next video. And like I always say, you too can follow your dreams with Sunrise Caravans.